you. Uh, you. Wrong insert. Uh, you. 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 Go away. Uh, actually, no. Keep that up. We do it this way. There we go. It's still so fucking loud sometimes. What the fuck? Alright. So, last time, we actually had just beaten the uh, third gym leader. We have our third gym badge. Yeah, uh, look here. So, here's where everything actually changes. Because this is where stuff's... Yeah, so hold on. Uh, where the fuck did I put my pen? Son of a bitch. There we go. All right. So, steam cave. All right. Let me move this over to a little bit here. get this open so I can keep an eye on where we're actually going to head. I need Helios City. So next is the Cave of Steam. I named it Steam Cave. Same thing. So, quick team recap. Oh yeah, we may actually fight the gym today. Uh, we'll have to see. We got Willy, a Kyogre, uh, holding an amulet coin, water type, naughty nature, Drizzle ability with Water Pulse, Ice Beam, Ancient Power, and Origin Pulse. Venus, our Venusaur, Grass Poison, not holding any item currently. Quiet Nature with Overgrow ability and Petal Blizzard, Growth, Petal Dance, and Razor Leaf. Metagross, Ground Bug, no item, Mild Nature. Poison Touch with x Poison Fang, Earthquake, and Dig. Robin, the Jirachi, holding Magnet, Steel, and Psychic type. Lax Nature, Serene Grace. Psychic, Zen Headbutt, the reason it is holding Magnet in the first place. Charge Beam and Wish. Obsidian, our Delta Octillery. Fire type, holding Charcoal. Sassy Nature, White Smoke with Flame Burst, Focus Blast, Mud Bomb, Flame Charge. And I, nope, Sunshine, our Togekiss, Fairy Flying type, not holding an item. Careful Nature, Hustle Ability. Sky Attack, Extreme Speed, Aura Sphere, and Air Slash. And then that is our team. Currently. Now, we get to go ahead for encounters. And I mean encounters for days. Uh, as a note, I do not fight trainers first time around because of I come back and fight them when I have to grind because it also helps me with money. Delta Noibat. Ooh, yes, please. And it's level 40. That's actually not that bad. Bill, uh, boy, bat, 
Um, I think what we are still going to do is I think I'm going to go until the gym. Uh, just for the reason of... Okay, don't kill it. It's, I think, steel and grass. So I think a water boost 12 levels up shouldn't kill. It is annoying about that, though. Yeah, I'm a dumbass. Fuck me. Uh, yeah, at the same time, there are people I can't avoid fighting. Oh, oh, this. Change of power and get the fuck off my screen. Oh, oh you're 47. That's why. And I get the step. That's great. All right. Um, if Willie gets to 55, uh, I think what I'll do is, uh, actually, if Willie gets to 56, uh, we'll train in a new Pokemon. Mainly for the reason of the gym is 55. Wireless. I Ice Beam you. You you just die to an Ice Beam. Rain's a water ice type. Honestly, I think Willy is just... Ugh. Willy's still the better of the two. I literally just ancient power this shit. Of course you have ice body, you piece of shit. Get the fuck off my screen. I'm out. The fuck is with these ice and water type? Ice, water, and dragon. Uh, I think I got a sail across. I also fought annoyed about using a legendary, and I was, I was like, oh, it won't kill. No, I'm stupid. I'm stupid as all hell. Okay, so this is Ultira Town. Now, hold on. There's a few things I want to look at something. Uh, no. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Like it matters. What is your ace? If. Fuck. Fuck. God. Fuck me. So we have a fight coming up. Where's my Pokemon Center? Give me the fucking Pokemon Center. Uh. <sighs> Detail the life of Satora Awada. It wishes him a sweet and peaceful rest. <laughs> first things first, heal. thing. Let's get the encounter. A halucha. Not bad. Ultira town. Ha. Uh, 
Lucha. To get new pens. Come on. Oh my god. Is this actually dead dead now? This is one of my longer pens I've had. Where the fuck is all my pens? I have like six of them. Six pens you can't fucking find. The fucking hell on earth. There we go. Alucha. Uh, honestly, I think I just throw a ball. Uh, back? It's nighttime. I throw a dust ball. I throw a dust ball and hope. <laughs> yeah. Well, what was that guy's name? Hold on. Okay. So this works out in two ways. So it's a wrestler Pokemon. And I'm going to I'm going to give you this is the reference, but I'm going to tell you it's not going to be it's not going to be spelled how you normally think it's going to be. And two, it's not who you think it is. If you follow wrestling, there's a wrestler named Ricochet. This is not supposed to be after him. There is a character in the show I used to watch as a kid called Mucha Lucha, and it has a character named Ricochet. I am naming it after the Mucha Lucha Ricochet. Okay. I realize I threw that dust ball. It's nighttime. But I also threw it in a building. I... Bravo. Northernmost house. Is it this house? You. Did what? In favor, I'm trying to turn up a fighting captain, but I am terrible deciding the best move sets for him. There's a book in the library called The Fighting Copiendum. Would you help? That could help, but I haven't been able to find it. You can get it for me. There will definitely be a reward in it for you. Alright. So, here we go. Let's have some fucking fun. Time to go and have a fucking fight. Boom. Oh, sorry. Oh, hey, Reaper. I'm so glad you made it. Welcome to Ulterior Town. It's a beautiful place. Nora, Reaper's finally here. Reaper, am I glad to see you? I heard about what happened at the Jade Tower. That horrific. It's hard to believe that the Augur was really the leader of the Sky Cult all along. If anything, though, that just makes what we're doing even more important. Remember a while ago when we first met? I told you about some ancient prophecy about the Pixies. Right, here in the Ulteria Library, it has the biggest collection of books in the region. I figured that if any one place could have information or even information on or even have that prophecy, it would be here. See, me and I are skimming through the sales trying to find information. I appreciate it. It helps out. First, you and I are... Hey, wait, you said I could go first. Sorry. See, me and I both have Mega Rings and Mega Evolutions on our team now. I want to test my team against Shear, so does Damien, though we shouldn't waste too much time. Why don't you pick? We're rivals, after all. So we should try to keep each other on our toes. What do you want about him? Well, Damien's a fucking nuisance and a pain in my ass, so fuck Damien, but at the same time, if you don't learn to keep your mouth shut about my secret, I'm gonna throw you in the same ditch I want to throw Damien in. You. Pat, told you he'd rather battle me. Let's get started then. You're going to see the true power of Mega Evolution. Fuck both of you. Deerling. Ice Beam. That's one. The Strike Fuck. 
I've seen a lot of the megas. Hi, Earthquake. Oh, fuck, it wasn't this one! Okay, Zipsharka has a mega in this game? <laughs> was expecting it to be that. Actually, no, Poison Fighting? Uh... There's Earthquake. It's a fucking Krogong. Got about the fire typing. I Earthquake more than ever. It's dead. <laughs> Going to Willy. I click Ice Beam. And I pray to God he doesn't die. Oh. Oh. Woo. 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 That actually had me worry. <laughs> Woo. Metacham. Uh, psychic fighting. or no. We all know about Metacham's Mega. So, uh. Ice Beam. Okay, that actually you lived that pretty well. Oh, fuck you, you're dead. Game. Why are you always beating me? Because get fucked. Oh, for Yaren's sake. I believe I lost again. How do you keep beating me? Anyways, now you're gonna head back in to keep searching. If you could help out, we would really, really appreciate it. Let's know if you find anything interesting. She comes across very strong, doesn't she? I ain't doing any work. She left it all to me. While I've been searching, she's been sitting around reading books on ancient Unovan languages of all things. I should probably go back in. If you could help out, we'd appreciate it. Oh, I nearly forgot. I found this on my coat after I got kidnapped back in Vipic City. It's just a hair, but I think it's from one of the Abyssal cultists. I'm not sure if it'll be useful to you, but Mew needs DNA to transform, right? Hopefully that'll help you out sometime in the future. Anyway, come and give us a hand. Oh, re... The joy of reading. Is that supposed to be like a reference to like, is that supposed to be an easter egg to reading Rainbow in Young Kids? If you need help, let me know. Uh, okay. So I need to look at this. There's a few things here. Uh, into the abandoned way, and into the east wing, and interact with the wall there, another, or another dorm out of the way. Okay, I don't care about that. Look, still get our west wing's northernmost location. That's where we're heading First, we're heading this way. I'm going to do this carefully. There. Okay. Right. Feeling you knew is located in the center wings, middle, northernmost bookcase at the far right end. Okay, information. And equations do with healing move. Please <laughs> located on the second floor of the west wing. Attached to the book of the note scientist dealing with their direction from perfection. Okay, so second floor. Okay, hold on. How the fuck do you get to the second floor? Alright, anyway. West wing, second floor. Hi, Elm. Hi, Oak. Okay. Hi, Elm again. There's a way to the second floor, I know that much. Uh, I just don't remember it. Uh... Abandoned wing, keep out. Abandoned wing, that's fine, refer to that might The prophecy is stored. I agree, nobody knows the prophecy except for the cult leaders. It would have, been, have to be hidden somewhere, most people wouldn't look. Ho ho ho! Are you three going into the abandoned wing? May I ask about what about it interests you? Oh, we're going to look for a very old book, sir. Shriners, you see, we're trying to take them to cults, and we figured that one prophecy about them might be back here. See, you'd be surprised at how many people look for that prophecy, Forest. I'll let you in, if you want. There's no prophecy back there, but there's that one glowing orb. An orb? What do you mean? 
spread. It's been there since the library was built. It's only one of the of many different odds and ends lying around in the wing. For a reason, people believe it has something to do with the prophecies, although they'll try and get it to react to them. I've already seen hundreds of people leave disappointed. Do you really want to waste your time? Well, we may as well try, right? Damien, for once in your life, you're right. Unless there's a first time for everything. Listen, please, I promise we'll be quick. Fine, but we really will need to be fast. I have a lot of things to do today. Alright, it's unlocked. The glowing orb is in the far end of the abandoned wing. I'll take you to go see it. Careful, though, there are both wild Pokemon and possibly evil trainers, even trainers back here. I need to look at something. Let's go find out what the future holds. Okay, there's something I want to look at here for a minute. Do... Okay, we're going back this way for a minute. Normally, a Delta Badoo is actually going to be our encounter. Fuck my life! I really just want to kill it for the fucking reasons, but King Goop's Claws will be fucking fantastic if I hit this. Just gonna throw a Pokeball at it. I'm sorry, bitch, what? Fine, you wanna be in your color scheme? Fine. Go fuck yourself. Uh, Delta Bidoo is a Tenta Cool. Alright. Jellyfish Pokemon! Oh, uh. Squishy. So now, the library encounters are, fuck me and the water types, man. Uh, I'm just gonna throw this on, hope for the best. See, this is where the issue comes in. I can't really hit it with anything. Like, I wish I was kidding, but I'm not. I might... Fuck this, I'm killing it. I don't care enough. Du Die. Hail. All right. The upside is not finding a lot of the trainers here is going to help in the long run. Hey Durant, do you really want to die? Not fuck off. I need to do this because, again, I've played to a certain ex I've gotten to a certain point, and I'll let you know that point. Um, I'll tell you right now, it's a very long point. I know what's coming up, and I need to make sure I'm prepped. There they are. Chin chin -o. Are we all here? See that glow over in the back? That's the orb that supposedly has to do with the prophecy. Seem like a load of, seems like a load of rubbish in my opinion. I doubt there even was a prophecy. It's probably just a legend. But anyway, go ahead, get this over with. Who dares wake me? What? What was that? What's happening? This, 
this has never happened before. So good to be awake again. Who do we have here? House guests? You're after the prophecy, you'll need to work harder than that. That's right, I'm the one who wrote it long ago, but, if, but you're dead wrong if you think I'll just tell you. I was the prophet of Arceus and the Oracle of Delphox. I have been preaching since before Hoenn was created. If you want to know the secret of the future, you'll have to take it by force. Ancient Oracle... Question, question, question mark. Oh, it's a Beldum. Um, my origin pulse here, honestly. It dies by itself anyway. Uh, Dragonair? No. Wait. I mean, I'll still hide. Issue is, I know the typing of this because I used one in my playthrough as a Delta Dragonite. I know the typing. Hi, Drodagon. You can die, Drodagon. I'm ancient powering. You can die. And yes, we're switching. I'm going Venus. That's a dark dragon. Fuck. Uh. Sunshine. It's gonna pursue. <laughs> Get predicted, bitch. I don't have a fucking fairy move. I just realized. Oh, you're dark. Or fear should kill. Oh, or not. Would you play? It's gonna kill it. Or not. You know, fuck me, right? Air slash. Off my field. And I literally just go and I click or fear here. You mother fuck. I got fucking priority, priority, bitch. All right. Hey, but if you did ancient oracle, question mark, question mark, question mark, dot, 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 dot. Ten K. Fuck. How the fuck do you have money? Heh, not bad. All right, I'll spill the beans. This prophecy has been misunderstood many, many times. Even cult leaders have never heard the correct version. Wait, so they don't know what the real prophecy says? That's right. I'm not going to read, you, read to you the entire thing. It's a terrible poem that's easy to be misinterpreted. I don't want to be that oracle, you know. I hope you're ready. <clears throat> the first thing predicted was the emergence of a hero chosen by a legendary Pokemon. I have been picked by... Five? Kyogre, Keldeo, Mew, Jirachi, Shop, uh, Mew, Jirachi, Keldeo, Victini, Kyogre. Hi. Secondly, this hero will succeed. I'm defeated and torn. They'll, they'll move on. Victorious. The last secret piece of information is that he, in the end of the end, the hero will join the Infernal Cult and betray their friends. That's basic. Wait, what? One of us is going to join the Infernal Cult? Now, what? You can't leave us with that. Who's the hero? How can we stop that from happening? You can't avoid fate, Nora. Well, you can't say he doesn't have a flair for the dramatic. This reminds me what author L. Frank Baum did when introducing... Oh, shut up! How can you stay so calm? We were just told one of us is a traitor. That This isn't a time to joke around. Well, if he, he did say that you'll get rid of the cult, right? I'm a librarian. As prophecies go, I've heard far worse. Nobody knows about this, right? You can use this to your, that to your advantage. But anyways, people are probably waiting for me at the front desk, so I need to head back. Let me know if you need any more help with... Well, with whatever library stuff I can help with. See you around, heroes. Nora, listen, don't panic about this, okay? Panic, Damien, we just got told that we are going to lose. People are going to die. Worrying about this isn't going to help. 
We need to work together if we're going to let this make us turn on. If we are going to let this make us turn on each other, we might as well give up now. Criticizing me already, Damien? Well, you know, if I were an infernal cultist in disguise, I wouldn't draw attention to myself. But of course, you wouldn't know anything about hat, about tact, would you? Not, mister. I ran my mouth in front of a cultist and got kidnapped in a garbage dump. Oh, please stop. You know what? I think Damien... I think you know what I think, Damien. I think your stepmother was right about you. I'm I'm going now. Going to go now. I'll see you in Sonata City Reaper. There's a gym there, and we'll need its badge in order to dive. Why did I say all of that? I don't know what came over me. Awful. I'm gonna go. I apologize. I really hope I didn't hurt him. I can't lose somebody else. Damien, wait up. Okay. So I. supposed to be a second floor I thought no bitch I am not dealing with fucking Pokemon right now I am escape roping the fuck Gotta go. this bitch all right so we're gonna go heal uh I don't think there's a second floor anymore actually so yeah. So, we head to Route 8. Okay. Oh, and x is our encounter, so... I can attempt ancient power and hope it doesn't die. I didn't actually. Cool. That is not good. Loud. Well, most Pokemon. Uh, I'm gonna name it Boom, actually. I hate Wobbuffets. I hate them with a fucking passion. They are literally the most terrifying thing to fight in a Nuzlocke. Oh, thank god you're dead. Mainly for Mirror Code and Counter, because fuck me, goddamn, are they a bitch. Uh, anything over there?
Cool. Alright, so we got our route 8 encounter. So we need to save here. So what I'm doing here is I'm saving in front of the grotto because you can reset the grotto until it has a Pokemon. So it's an item. So I close Insurgent and I bring Insurgent right back up. The reason I'm doing, I'm going to put it over here for a minute. You can't go in and out and then save because if you go in and then out and save that item is already there so it's registering it it is not registered before i walk in so since i haven't walked in where i save it is by definition actually uh hasn't picked if it wants to be an item or a pokemon so i enter Although, right now, this uh, tactic is very much blowing up my face. I'm going to... I'm going to drop that for a minute. Just so you guys don't have to keep hearing it so loud. Pokemon! So now, just because it shows it's a spritzy, it is actually a... Pumpkaboo! Okay. Uh. Not Pokemon. Bag. And we'll go ahead and. Here's an Ultra Ball. Okay. Because I can't, I can't hit this at all. Um, uh, cool. You could throw a Nuzlocke ball and hope for the best. Like, I seriously cannot hit this. I hit it once with anything, and it's dead. And I have no status inflicting moves. I may have to kill it. Fuck me, goddamn! I got a fucking random-ass itch on my side. Yay, talk. So what are we gonna nickname it? Pumpkaboo... Pumpkin Pokemon, Ghost Grass, they can't. They're wandering spirits to the place where they belong. Ooh. Um. Uh, name of Jack. And yes, it's named Jack as in Jack a Lantern. Fucking judge me. things. I'm not on the water. So you cheat. Alright. Welcome to Miara Town. Miara Town now is uh, Miara Town, my favorite place in Doran. Lovely, lovely town is peaceful, serene, and built over the shining sea. And of course, the world islands now will ju rest just a rod away. It's almost a shame, really. Perhaps that when I flood the region, I'll leave this town for last. At last, the sea is awakening once more. It's time to bring its king, bring its king, its his crown. So, there's a few things we're gonna do here. Um, we're not gonna get all our encounters right now. Um, mainly because I'm getting hungry, and I think I want to switch to Batman soon. So, what I think I'm gonna do is we'll get the Miara Town encounter. See, the Miara Town encounters a mammoth slime. I should have bought Pokeballs first. I'm stupid. Miara Town Mammoth Slime. Okay. 
So. Uh, it's 54 like me, so I, th I think I can Origin Pulse it and not worry. Even though it's Rain Booster, Drizzle, and it's super effective. I should have Ice Beam. Alright. So, there's going to be a few things I need to bring up. So, I'm going to write down a few places that we have to... Counter. And with that, I'm going to write them down. So, below us, we have the Stormy Seas. Whirl Islands. And... We have the... Raid out. Oh. And I know what's on there, so I'm going to write a fourth down. We still, would have, we still have normally four encounters here. Like I said, I'm very much in the mood to kind of continue with getting us to like city grinding, and then what I think we'll do instead is We'll fight the gym. Sorry, but this blue orb was donated to us by an important sponsor. It's very valuable, so I'll need to accompany you if you want to take a closer look. Sound good? Yeah. This orb has quite the history. Powered Kyogre back in the days of the beginning of the universe. Gimme, 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 gimme. It also evolved in the Aqua Hoenn conflict 50 years ago. Used by Archie to revert Kyogre to its primal form. Your time stamp takes place 50 years after Horus. It was generously donated to us by someone who wishes to remain. Oh, no way. Uh, hello, miss. I was just in a speech about this orb. Perhaps you. Oh, no, sorry. I'm only here for the relic. Ma'am, I'm sorry, but I can't. Say, but let's make this easy for both of us. I'm sure you know of the Abyssal Cult. You mean the terrorists? Are you trying to intimidate me? Well, yes, actually, I'm kind of a murderer. It'd be easier for both of us if you just moved. You don't even look like one of their members. That's because I'm not. I'm the leader. Thank you. What are you planning to do with it? No, oh, you tell me. What could the leader of the Abyssal Cult possibly want with the artifact of Lugia? You, you must want it to summon... Wait, what? The blue orb is Kyogre's artifact, not Lugia's. Ah, here it is. Secret compartment. Clever. It's hard to believe the title bell was e this easy for the title bell, but, but please, why would I want some cheap plastic ball when Lugia's bell is rusting underneath it? But that's the blue orb, the legendary artifact of Kyogre. You're absolutely right, but that's not the orb. Fake, how did you, how do you know? How do you know the bell was there? The best place to hide something is in plain sight. Nobody would think to look for the bell next to a fake orb. Well, this cheap plastic ball here, I donated it. Why? Well, as the leader of the Abyssal Cult, everyone assumes I'm after Kyogre. Naturally, people don't want me getting my hands on the Blue Orb. Having a copy of that is in a guarded museum, well, that's better. What better way to make everyone think I don't already have it? And don't you think I have? I don't think I haven't noticed you there, Reaper. You're the one that Mew chose. If you want to stop me? Bring it. I'll be waiting. South of the uh, Miara lies the current location of the Royal Island. When you're ready to lose? Just stop on by. Your name? Just who exactly? I need to report the sense of my superiors. Oh man, I'm going to be in so much trouble. Do I actually have to go there? Uh... Uh, hold on. Okay. Take it back. We got two encounters coming up. <laughs> and by that I mean, I forgot this is part of the story that you have to do. Oh, fuck me, man. I hate the in World Islands. I hate them in both games. I hate them in this and I hate them in fucking uh, gold, silver, crystal, heart gold, soul silver. Pain in my ass. Stormy Seas is a hunter. Think this carefully through here. Pokeball. I didn't 
buy more Pokeballs. Fuck! Okay. Pokemon. Ooh. I normally name them Spookerton, but or Spookerina, but I want to try something. Hold up, uh, Gengar. Oh, you know what? I do it because a uh, Mega works well, and so does the Gigantamax. Uh, fucking our go. Uh, you know what? I could do it this way. I can't remember what it's called. This thing. This is the thing I was looking for. Named it this in my... Uh, Sword and Shield. G Max Gengar is named this in Sword and Shield. Stormy Seas. We are actually going to backtrack for a minute. He's a fuck! What the fuck is my legendary luck recently? I don't want to fight this yet. We're gonna do a bunch of different things real quick. Uh, Pokemon Center. So let's do this first. You. You. We're gonna buy. Anything to you. We're gonna buy. Five of you. We're gonna buy. Nineteen of you. And we're gonna buy 19 a year. And then I have the escape rope that I need. Okay. Uh, heal. Okay. So, here's what we're about to do. The reason I did all that is I needed to. Why, you may ask? Well, I didn't. We we're gonna have like Pokemon battles out the fucking ass, and I didn't really want to deal with that. Bag. Max Repel. Wait, thanks for Thunderwave. Uh. All right. 
Squirrel Island encounter. In Altaria? Ooh, I want to say I can ancient power this, but it might die. Oh, fuck yeah. There are a lot of great balls. Or ultra balls, I mean. <sighs> that I don't like. That is a heaping helping of fuck my life. I feel like if I don't do this, my mom would kill me. But I'm gonna name it Puff. Um... Mother, every once in a while, she'll go nuts. And, like, I mean, like, the jokingly nuts. And she'll do it to bother me and my sister, and she'll just start singing Puff the Mag Magic Dragon. The Altaria is a dragon. Puff the Magic Dragon. Okay, now... I have a feeling fucking have, uh... No. Hell no. This is just me waste losing a lot of money. But it's for a reason. Um, I'd much rather keep my Pokemon as healthy as possible than none at all. I was getting worried you wouldn't show up. After all, we wouldn't want to start without our special snowflake hero, would we? The Royal Islands are home to one of the oldest living creatures. Lugia, the guardian of the sea, the Storm Slinger. It's graced us with its presence since the days of gold. But now the Royal Islands is home, have returned. The domain of a legendary Pokemon isn't an ordinary place. It's connected to that Pokemon's artifact. That's why the Hall of Origin only appeared to Dawn when she brandished the Azure Flute. Now that I have my the bell, it'll bend to my will. Now merge, Lugia. You'll be mine. You'll become my. You will become my pawn, and soon the world will tremble in fear. Welcome, Storm Slinger. My name is Audrey. I am the leader of the Abyssal Cult. With your strength and my leadership, this planet can be ours. We have great plans for the world, Lugia, but we need your help to pull them off. What do you say? Will you join us? Will you work under me? Reaper? Are you satisfied? Satisfied? Did you see what you came to see? Of course you are. You want a battle, but here's the thing. If you win, it's not like I'll release Lugia and leave. Why would I? Beating me won't change a thing. You walked right into a trap. If you win, you get nothing, but if I win, you lose everything. Your friends, your life, and your chance at saving the region. And the Nuzlocke! I'll give you a chance to prepare. I won't indignify the Storm Slinger by having it fight a weakened opponent. Let me know when you're ready to battle. Oh, God, help me. This is as close. I think this is as best I'm going to be. Very well, Reaper. If you're ready to take on Lugia, then let's begin. Cult leader Audrey would like to battle CDOT. Okay, what the fuck? I have seen the CDOT in this fucking series like what, six times? It's a make it. I actually forgot the fucking music for this. This is good music. Actually, I'm not going to speed through this. Uh, I air slash you. Mankey, dead. You're still a steel type? Or you're not a steel type yet. You're just straight water. I'll speed up the switch out. I hit charge beam here. Yeah. 
out of the one Pokemon, you pick the one that has three different possible outcomes. I think it's Grass, Rock, Ground, Bug, and fucking Steel Psychic. <sighs> okay. They all have a straight weakness of fire. Minus the ground typing, that kind of neutralizes it. I focus, but... Live, Obsidian! Live, Obsidian! Obsidian! Oh! Time to switch! That still does so much damage! I origin pulse you. Get the fuck off my screen! Semi triggered. Oh no. Uber triggered. Yikes. I hate Mill Tank fucking triggers me. Yeah, you die. You weren't supposed to actually miss that. No, no, no. Oh. Die, 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 die. Oh my god! I knew I said I wasn't gonna skip it, but fuck that! After Obsidian almost died? What? How did you. Let's say I'm impressed. You defeated both Lugia and my Crowdon. Huh? Uh, you want to make sure your fucking Lugia is not a Stantler like the Rayquaza? <laughs> oh, that was great. Fine, I'll let you live for now, but be warned, Reaper. If you ever cross my path again, I might not be so merciful. Time to move on to the next phase. Abyssal Cult, move out. We need to go. We need to like get the fuck out of. We need to get the fuck out of here. I don't want to deal with that shit anymore. <laughs> oh fuck! What was my world island? Uh, Altaria. I need to make sure I write that down real quick. And I want to go check on something. I think we have a box full of Pokemon. If we do, I'm not going to be too worried about losing certain mons. Like, I already have backups for Obsidian. If Obsidian went down there, I was getting Glalie. That's not what I meant to do. I was sitting in box two for some reason. Oh, that's right. That's a token. This is our team. This is our box. Walnut, Fun Girl, VR, Uni, Sunny, Victory, Firefly, Pop, Cyano, Skulker, Prism, Raven, Zuko, Basilisk, Sunny, Lena, Jesse, Ricochet, Squishy, Boom, Jack, Mifuno, and Puff. And then we have our two murdered po uh, which was pancakes and cake cocktail. AKA cake. We are about to fill up an entire box of encounters though. Alright. Let me write down Altaria for a minute, because I'm gonna forget if I don't. Altaria.
Okay. One moment. As I throw myself all the way back to where I need to be. Okay. Hey, kid. Are you okay? I heard that you went down to the Royal Islands to challenge the Abyssal Cult. It's really stupid. You could have gotten hurt. It's all my fight. I let, well, I let Aldry take that bell. Here, at the very least, you should take this. It's a token of my apology. Open a thing for flute. That flute can let you wake up sleeping Pokemon, such as Snorlax on Route 8. It's almost like that's exactly where I'm going. Snorlax, attacked in rage. Ooh, it's Ignite. Actually not upset about that. Like, literally very much okay with that. I actually may have to switch Pokemon to... Yeah, because it is a starter. So they have increased catch rates. Um... I'll go Obsidian. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um my sister was calling about a question. Uh, yeah, I go Obsidian. And I hit Mud Bomb and hope to God nothing bad happens. It shouldn't kill? It's an Octillery versus a Pig Knight, yeah. Um, honestly, I Flame Charge it. Just to get it in the red. Um... And then I, I, I throw Nuzlocke balls. That's all I do. I'm a little pissed. I wouldn't have been as pissed if he lived and Bork and killed himself, because that's what I was going to name it. The fact that I just lost Obsidian because of it, I'm fucking livid. F bitch, I sw- oh. off. What? Oh, uh, hole. Damien Nora. Third person. Fucking cheated. Another was Obsidian. God fucking damn it. Literally after I made. Oh, it's okay if Obsidian dies. No, if, if, if Obsidian had died and Borkin was still alive, or if the Pig Knight was still alive and I caught it, cool. Yeah, that's fine. The fact that it killed itself and Obsidian, I'm pissed. Well. Um, we're gonna take uh, Zuko here. Zuko's gonna go in here, and unfortunately, 
Obsidian has been with us literally since the beginning. I am uh, going to retrieve the charcoal, and we are now definitely not fighting the gym tonight. Um, I am going to have to grind Zuko up to the current team. Uh, however, that does also does state that I do have to change this. Me, man. Did I heal at all? Oh, let's let, let my dumbassery get Willy killed. This is why you never say, oh, it's fine if this Pokemon dies because fucking shortly after, this Pokemon is going to die. I fucking used another repel. Big night at fucker. I literally wrote pig night that fucker for that encounter. Motherfucker. I'm, ooh, I'm now I'm pissed. Welcome to Route 9. Oh, you're late. Never late, you're just early. Why did you want to see me? I thought our deal was finished. I thought so too. Then I met Reaper in Telnor Town. He came into my tower and defeated Rayquaza. He thought my crystal went, was shattered. Not only that, but he remembered. Not a whole lot, but he knew his name. The loan is too much. If anyone recognizes him, care to explain? I gave you the kid. I promised to leave you and your cult alive when I came into power. All I asked was asked of you was to deal with one small child. Yeah, you couldn't even do that. What went wrong? And choose your words. Carefully, they might be your last. We were very close to completing the memory wipe. Before we were done, our ritual began and we were forced to leave. When I returned, he was gone. During that time, the only person recorded leaving the base was a dark right cultist who looked eerily similar to a member we had sacrificed a long time ago. Any suggestion? Yes. I believe that Reaper was somehow has somehow been found and rescued by Mew. So Mew finally decided to show its face. I could deal with them myself. It would be easy to use the media to portray them as fugitive. But... All well, the found out I lost to them, that I let criminals escape, my reputation would be ruined. Persephone? I've been doing some research into the crystal of the first dogger. I'm not entirely sure, but I have a hunch about where he may have found it. If I'm right, there may be a conspiracy in Torn bigger than I could ever imagine. Actually, I'm going to investigate this. If, when I come back, if you still haven't completed your end of the deal, I'll stop doing mine and bring my full wrath down on your Shade Forest base. Chew on that for a bit. I'm the anti-hero, Persephone. A chaotic good character. I'll do whatever I need to to save the world. You're a chaotic evil motherfucker. Stand in my way and you'll be swept aside too. Those are the lawful evil, really. Actually, no, that is fair. It's a lawful evil. No wonder nobody likes him. If only he wasn't as invulnerable as uh, First Dogger was. I would have dealt with him long ago now. Who can I send after Reaper? Oh, nine encounter is it, Politod? You know what? I'm just so sick of the water types. Get it the fuck out of my face. What did I? You know what? Bitch, you're out of your fuck. See you. Politod. Don't care. I'm so sick of seeing water type, water type, water type. Now I gotta fight this fucker. I calculate my chance of losing at approximately 10.2%. Let's go. You better make that a 100% chance. Oh, it's a drink. You better make that a 300%. Because, uh. Lock, load, bang, dead. Get out of my face. I forgot to divide the variable. No, you forgot that you didn't know I had a fucking Kyogre following me because you're blind as fuck. And if I'm right, this is not a city? 
Welcome to Sonata City. Where we are going to save. We're going to heal and save. That's it for today on Insurgent. Uh, I'm going to grind the rest of the team up to... So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grind this entire team to 56 like Willie. 56 or 57. One of the two. Or around there. Uh, depending on how stuff goes, it might be a little more. Then, next time, we're going to fight the gym. We have one, two, three more encounters we can do. Um, I'm thinking about turning eggs into tokens, because I'm not 100% sure if they're randomized or not, but I'll have to wait and see. But, thank you all so much for watching. We lost Obsidian today. That pig knight pissed me off. I'm done with the search for the day. I'm going to switch to my... I'm going to close this. I'm going to close that first. I'm going to switch... Uh, full screen on this. Dude.